Welcome back everybody, Adam Solowitz here. Today, we're gonna to be talking about this guy, a spoon. Something so simple, but yet plays a huge role in a professional kitchen. Do you ever wonder why a chef always has a spoon on him? Well, because it's probably one of the most used tools in any kitchen besides a chef's knife. So today, we're gonna go over the uses of this bad boy. Number one, de-seeding a cucumber. So, cut the cucumber in half, and then use this bad boy to take the seeds right out, as you've probably seen in my hummus video. Two, avocado. I've seen a lot of people fiddle around with an avocado, trying to remove the pit, mutilating it, and who knows what, when it's really so simple. Half the avocado, remove the pit, and then use the spoon to remove the meat of the avocado. And I'll post a link to how to prep an avocado somewhere right above me. Three, measuring. When you're looking at recipes, you'll see a tablespoon, teaspoon, things like that. Well, guess what? A spoon is a tablespoon. Two tablespoons equals an ounce. So, when you're working on recipes in a kitchen, it's a simple measuring tool, and it comes in handy all the time. Four, peeling ginger. Peeling ginger is a pain if you're trying to use a regular peeler. The edge of the spoon to peel the ginger makes it a whole lot easier. Not just that, you can get through all the crevices of the ginger and make sure that you're using 100% of the product. So, bet you didn't think of that one. Five, plating. So you can use a spoon for plating sauces and purees and making them look unique. So one being the swoosh. Two being the drop and drag. And three, which is one of the newer techniques that I've seen and I like to use occasionally, is the splat. Six, when also used with plating, a spoon becomes handy when you need to pick up product and put it on the plate in a specific position. Some people like to use tweezers, some people like to use tweezers and a spoon. I'm a spoon guy, I like using a spoon. So definitely comes in handy for plating. And last, but not least, and it's probably the most important, is tasting your food. So in every kitchen that I've ever worked at, you need to taste the food that you're making. And a spoon is used for just that. I'm gonna eat this. A spoon is a very, very important piece of kit that should be in every single kitchen. I personally always have one on me all the time. Whether it be five or six disposable spoons, or one metal spoon for plating, or any of the other uses that I explained in today's video. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Please subscribe. And again, my name is Adam Solowitz, and this is a spoon, and as always, eat well.